Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, Rat here from Ratko Tarot and this is going to be Virgo Sun, Virgo Moon and Virgo Rising weekly tarot reading June 25th to July 1st 2018. So with that being said, first card for Libras, uh, for the topic of their week that is going to be the strength card. Then we do have the core of the situation for them, that will be the Nine of Swords. Third card is going to represent challenges for uh, Virgos. This is going to be uh, the Tree of Pentacles. And last but not least, we do have the core, uh, the guidance here, which is going to be the Sun card. So for what it seems, Libra, that week is going to present you with a um, an enterprise, all right, that you are going to find yourself very reluctant on taking. Why? It is because, let me put them more to the center here. All right, so why? It is because we do have the Nine of Swords and that card generally prerequisites you to uh, being afraid of a failure, all right, to jump into this uh, particular enterprise. Either a, an approach for a new relationship, activity into one relationship, or a new project, etc., etc. That card rather points that you would be, you would want to rather remain po uh, passive regarding this, uh, as I said, enterprise, because um, first of all, the strength card here points that you wouldn't like it in general that much, all right? It will be, you will, you will be rather indifferent regarding it. And on the second, um, on the second note, you would rather want to be at a different place or or kind of like with a different people. Nonetheless, guys, it is very important what is going to be presented to you. This is displayed here by the challenges and by the guidance, which is the sun card. Well, with challenges, it will it seems that it's going to be very difficult for you to, uh, for you to cooperate with those people or in general with those kind of. Uh, activities that you got to involve yourself in but through that cooperation you are going to receive a very important support that is going to support you throughout your further development either into your career or either into your relationship as well as you are going to discover many different approaches in the, in the sense of that you are going to discover what you are doing wrong so far either relationship wise or either career wise so it's kind of like a, a mutual exchange of experience what you're going to have so this particular enterprise will involve other people into it as well all right that could be very well um Hey, uh, some sort of a a, a group or a, um, how can I say it? a club? For example, I'm sorry I'm giving that example, but that could be a club of anonymous alcoholics, you know, people who has to go there, they are usually afraid or very skeptical and they think that there is other way around it here, all right, but once they go, it is difficult to cooperate with others, but in the same time when they start cooperating, they are seeing how much damage they have done to themselves and to the people around them and also they are receiving receiving that uh, support that is going to support them throughout their development further into the future. So instead of being ignorant and instead of um, Virgos believing that uh, you can handle it on your own, all right, you need to have a little bit more faith into others. That is displayed here by the Sun card because the Sun card it is also a, about cooperation in a very pure level with others. In a level where one is posi very positive, uh, has a very positive attitude that everything or everybody around them is going to help them and it is what is going to happen here. Especially if your problem is anger. All right, The Sun card points that as soon as you start cooperating with others, they will help you manage your anger and not just manage your anger but also bury the tomahawk of war somewhere and not be so angry all the time every time because that could be very well a, a huge issue here with the strength card because uh, there is a, a two version of interpretation and on the strength card either the woman is trying to close the mouth of the lion or either the woman is trying to open 
the mouths of the lion. So you could be either very passive or you could be either very aggressive and either way you need to kind of have the mouth halfway open. So in other words you need to tame the beast within and that will happen as I said through a, a cooperation with other but the first step to do so is to recognize that you cannot do it on your own. That is the topic of uh, the core of the situation of your particular week. So I hope that you will become a, a much better person when it comes a better in a sense of that uh, you know much more humble and much more happier after that particular week and with that being said this was your weekly tarot reading Virgo for the upcoming June 25th to July 1st 2018. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and in case you're interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video. Rat signing out now, see you next time. Bye!